Well, folks, today we're back at the scout camp. I've got a group with me here today. Um, my buddy Dylan, who's behind me, my friend uh, Frank, Michael, and Jay have uh, joined me on the hunt today. So we're going to see what we can dig up here at uh, this location on this beautiful day. So stick around. Okay, I found my first target of the day here, which is a wheat scent. And I can't make the date out, 1940 something. That actually might be just 1940. We'll go with that, but uh, first target here today at the scuff camp. Okay, Dylan, what do you have there? Well, it looks like it'd be part of a necklace, a religious. Well, it sure does, symbol, doesn't it? Like a, a Bible. Yeah. You got a cross there, and then it looks like a. Let's see what it looks a like Joseph and Mary, or maybe Christ and Mary. Something like that. Yeah, give it our brush. See what you. That's beautiful. That's pretty nice. I almost didn't dig it up because it sounded kind of trashy, but. Oh yeah. Here, we'll give it another squirt here. Hey, that's a sweet find, man. Yeah. What about on the back? Turn her over. Icon. Anything? Mm. Well, there's definitely something on the back there. Oh, yeah. Two more. Um, oh, maybe that's just the back of the engraving on the front. Yeah. Very cool, man. Yeah. Nice find, brother. Bad. Thanks. Here we found an old uh, Weber fishing lure spinner. Pretty close here to the water's edge. All right, here's another wheat scent here about uh, Three inches down, maybe, I think. Second weedy. We have here, I think we have a ring. No, what do we have? Earring, maybe? Oh, I think this might be a ring. Sweet. Roots are around the ring. I'm having a hard time getting it out. There we go. Well, that's cool. Looks like those might be opals or something like that. That's a cool find. Okay, pretty pumped. That ring is pretty cool. Not sure of the type of metal. Um, we'll see. We'll take a close look at it. But you know, you, you may have you may have noticed I'm not wearing my lucky silver socks. Um, I'm wearing shorts, and uh, from a fashion perspective, they, they wouldn't match real well um, with with my current shoes. But I am wearing my lucky silver um, gator or um, buff which is available for sale on my Teespring store. So check it out. Um, all the profits from there and my channel, of course, are donated to the Wounded Warriors Project. So something fun and who knows, it uh, might have brought me luck today, might bring you luck if, if you pick one up. So, all right, let's get on to the next hole.
Dylan, what day is it? Spoon day. Spoon day. <laughs> Surface find. All of them together? All of them scattered around. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's crazy. I found one bizarre spoon. Um, of course, in addition to my doorknob here. <laughs> Go figure that. Somebody was, was knocking. But it was a different type of a spoon than that. Um, it's going to be way at the bottom of my bag here, maybe. I won't be able to find it. Oh, yeah. Well, I think, I think it's a spoon. Like the a handle slash spoon, or that could just be a handle of something. I don't know. Okay, this is a nice signal. You probably know here, 93, 94, that could be anything from most likely modern quarter, but uh, that's also silver dime range. Boy, in this hot weather, we want to dig these plugs, flip them over, get them sealed as soon as possible so those roots don't dry out there. What do you think, folks? Quarter is my guess. Okay, it's in our spoils pile here. Oh, there we go. Modern quarter. We're looking at, oh, 1965. We were robbed by one year, folks, 1965. 1964, of course, and earlier is when the, the quarters were, were made of silver. All right, yet another wheat scent here. Not real deep here, just on the trail here, trail side. This one's in better shape than the others. We'll take a look at the dates of these on the wrap up. I'm going to dig them out here. This might take a second here. So. Okay. What do yeah, you got have, there, Michael? We have uh, three wheats here. You can hardly see them. These are pretty toasty. So there's three wheats. And I, I believe one's 1917. Yeah. But then the coolest find is there are two buffalo nickels in here. And oh, I, my gosh. And yeah. They're, and they're both dated as far as I can tell. I can't quite see it, but it looks like maybe one's 1916 and 1918. Sweet finds. Got a couple quarters there and yeah. uh, is that a copper yep coppers yeah. couple yeah. memorials and a dime a dime so, way so to go bro good. yeah good job man thank you all right i have no idea what this is it looks a little odd to me this is ringing up in the high 80s okay it's round Oh my gosh, what do we have here? It seems light. Is this a token? I think this is a token. Way too light to be a coin. Yeah, you can see some of the edges chipped there. What the heck do we have here? Some writing on there. Yeah, this is one of these tokens that you would print out, I think at a convenience store, five and dime store, right? And you would uh, pick the letters and uh, it would print on on this. I think that's what it is. I think I can, oh, make out a few of the letters here. Okay, there we go. We'll see if we can get a better look at it during the wrap up. Okay, this was about three, four inches down in the hole. Okay, I think we have another. This is an older neckerchief right here. All right, a good 93-94 signal here in the hole. I think we're going to be able to scoop this out here. It's going to be a modern quarter, of course. 80-something. 1984. Well, the heat has gotten the best of me, folks. 
Um, we started today, I think around, I'll say 9 a.m. And uh, it's about uh, almost two o'clock here. So really hot day. Had a good hunt though. I'm glad my friends were able to join me. Let me share with you my finds for the day. Okay, we found uh, a, a tent stake here. We found some trash. Definitely dug the whole tabs today. A few other random items as well. Um, some big iron. Interesting. This was near the beach. This is a handle off of something. Um, I thought at first it might be a spoon, but not sure what that is. An old fishing lure, a piece of a of a pipe, smoking implement, doorknob. Boy, did we find a ton of Lincoln memorials today, and four wheat cents. Four wheat cents. I will try to get the dates off of those, and if I can read them, I'll post them in the video during the finds. Three dimes, two quarters, of course, one of which was 1965. A good luck token of sorts. What would a day detecting at the scout can't be without finding a scout slide or two? And then uh, find of the day, this nice ring. Um, not sure, do not think this is silver. Um, I'll take a closer look at it, but uh, I can already see some of the patina coming off of that so at best that's plated but um, nevertheless it was exciting to find that well it's a wrap as always thanks for watching these videos uh, if you're not a subscriber why not hit the subscribe button the notification bell and guess what we'll see you on the next video happy digging